In this video series, we're going to analyze the effects of feedback on amplifiers, or at least skim the surface of this sort of broad and interesting question of how feedback, how we can use feedback. Um, we spent a lot of time building up to op amps up until this video, and op amps are designed to be used in feedback, so this is a timely topic. We need to understand how feedback affects our op amps behavior. Uh, we're going to find that it affects it pretty dramatically, um, and we'll use control theory to explore those and uh, identify that it can control the gain of our amplifier or modulate its input and output impedance or do a variety of other interesting things. Um, we'll also determine some stability criteria for our amplifiers so that we can make sure to stay on the right side of feedback and not wind up with uh, circuits that are unstable. Um, we'll be working on using feedback to improve our amplifiers in uh, this video series and then next video series we will use feedback to embrace instability and make oscillators.